I thank the gentleman from New Jersey. And, Mr. Speaker, I rise today in strong support of the Paul Wellstone Mental Health and Addiction Equity Act. This bipartisan bill is the product of many months and even years of thoughtful negotiation. And I congratulate the authors of this legislation, Congressman Kennedy and Congressman Ramstad, on their work to, to move this bill forward. And I might add that I did know Paul Wellstone, and I knew Sheila very well, too. And I know that both of them were strong advocates on this issue. I, like many others, have personally felt the effects of mental illness in my family. My mother struggled with mental health issues for as long as I could remember. And I know firsthand how difficult and draining her struggle was. We have all heard the statistics. One in every five people in our country will experience a mental illness this year. Many of these individuals will seek treatment. And without this legislation, many would be denied. This is unacceptable. I hope today this House will understand the importance of equal access to treatment for those suffering from mental illness. I was elected to this House to do the right thing for the people of the 2nd District of Iowa and the right thing for the people of America. This is the right thing to do, and I urge my colleagues to support this bill, and I yield back the balance of my time.